Hey what's up guys, that Gamer TV here and welcome back to a video that I haven't really done many times before and that is we are going to be looking at Posh and Southend United for the game tomorrow. So this is what's going to be talked about. So, so we look at Posh, our last three games we've been on bad form recently. We lost 3-1 to Bradford City away, we lost 1-0 to AFC Wimbledon away and we lost 2-1 to Coventry City at home which obviously I went to that game. So our form hasn't been great. We, we, last time we won a game was on the 2nd of March in, in a great 4-2 win against Wickham Wanderers and it, it, it was it was really good to see Matt Godden get two goals in that game. It's, it's, ni it's nice that he's been getting back on form because he hasn't been on fire with the goals recently. So now we are looking at South End. They lost 3-0 to Barnsley, they drawn 2-2 with Blackpool, they lost 4-1 to Scunthorpe, and they lost 1-0 to AFC Wimbledon. So their form has been way worse than ours. And now I'm going to get on to the score predictions and what I think Darren Ferguson is going to set up the team. So as you guys may have heard from the posh news, that Darren Ferguson, our manager who was only appointed to be there for the rest of the season. He has now signed a three-year contract, which, to be honest, I'm not really happy about because since he's been appointed manager, we've we've only got two, two wins since he's been appointed manager, and it's not good enough. The rest of them we've like, either drawn or lost. Most of them we've lost. So now we're going to look at the table. It looks like our fight for promotion is definitely off. Posher now dropped into eighth place, and in that top four is Portsmouth, Sunderland, Barnsley and Luton. And then we look at Southend. They are in 20th on 42 points. And Posh are in 8th on 55 points. So we, so first of all, we definitely need to get a win. Because we, we've, been, we, we've been losing quite a lot of times to relegation teams. We've lost to Bradford. We lost to AFC Wimbledon. It's just really not good enough. I just feel like the players just aren't trying. And they need to get this win. So now I'm going to go over the team and what I think Darren Ferguson is going to set up the team for. So my predicted lineup, I am going to go for Conor O'Malley in goal, and Jason Naismith, Ben White, Daniel Lafferty and Tyler Denton at the back. And then I'm going to go for Lewis Reed. Um, he, he hasn't really started games much. He's always been on the bench, but I think Darren Ferguson will give him a go. Uh, Joe Ward, of course, he's definitely going to start. Like, why would he not be in the starting eleven? Uh, Callum Cook is also going to be alongside, I think he's going to be alongside with him in the centre midfield. Marcus Madison as the centre forward. And up front, I'm going to go for Godden and Tony. And um, at, at the moment, I've been I've been missing Suriki Dembele. Like, if Suriki Dembele would have been in the rest of our games, then we would have won some games that we lost. So... And on the bench, I'm I'm going to go for Aaron Chapman, Josh Knight, Ryan Tapazzoli, and Seb Bassong. Now, since Seb Sebastian Bassong, who we signed from, uh, who used to be at Newcastle before, and then he went to Norwich a few seasons ago, and now he's joined a posh. I think he's he's only I've only seen him play once, only once in a posh shirt, and that was when posh played. I, 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 can't, I can't remember who, who they play against, but I, I think it was just in a cup game. And I think we won. And, you know, I, I think he he would definitely be a promising player for the future. And that's why I just feel that he needs to start more. Right, guys, so that's going to be it for this video. Hopefully you all enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to give the video a big fat thumbs up and subscribe. Leave a comment below and I'll see you all for the match day tomorrow.